Hello, Diggory Haydoke here with another vintage gun for you. This is everybody's favourite, the Purdy Sidelock Ejector. Patented by Beasley in 1880, it's probably the byword for best English guns. This gun really set the standard in its day for everything else to follow. And in many people's opinions, it's not been bettered. It's a complicated gun, which is why not many people copy it. But if made properly out of the best materials, as Purdy's always are, it's hard to beat. It's a proper self-opener, which means barrels jump open of their own accord under pressure, in this case, from the main springs. Not like the Holland and Holland from a separate system under the fore end. Everything here is run off the main spring. When the gun is open, the main spring is relieved of tension. When you close the gun, you're putting the mainspring under tension. That's why it's such a powerful action. It's got a very, two very strong mainsprings here acting on it. Now, critics of the Purdy will tell you that it's a hard gun to close. It's not. It's like any piece of equipment. You need to learn how to use it properly. And here we're going to look, look at loading, shooting and firing a Purdy with no effort at all. The trick, rest it on your hip, slightly oblique like that, hold the gun well down the forend, a little wiggle of the hip, and the gun's closed. It's a self-opener, so you can open it one-handed. And now we're going to have a look at it on a simulated driven pair. Could be better than that.